The tale of a couple who allegedly stamped a 10-year-old housemaid uh, with hot iron and drove a nail into her head for not keeping up to her duty at midnight has left many in Enugu state troubled. A neighbor raised the alarm when the girl screamed in the middle of the night and came out with blood dripping from her head and several bones on her body. TVC News' Bamidele Ajayi completes the story. It is a scene of torture, inhuman and cruelty. A 10-year-old maid has been stamped with odd pressing iron with a six-inch nail driven into her head. The incident that got the attention of the state government and the coalition of civil society organizations who are now calling for justice for the daughter of a widow with four children. We frown so much against that story because we heard the child is only but 10, which means she really cannot take decisions for herself. Parading the suspects, the Commissioner of Police now arrested the incident that led to the arrest of the couple who was later arraigned at a magistrate court. While these people ungodly maltreated the child, used nail on her head, put Pepe in her private part. A mild drama ensued between the duo as the couple openly accused themselves of complicity before the state police commissioner. I say that it's me that did it because of, I don't want to sack my husband the work or let him to go to prison. That's why I say it's me that did it. But the person that did that thing is him. Any injury you saw on that girl's, um, um, that girl's body, it's, it's my woman that do that. I did not inflict any injury. What about the iron you put on her back? An iron. I used iron to threaten her, but I did not inflict any injury. The state government has ordered the girl to be moved to a state medical facility with a promise to offset her bills and place her on life scholarship. The government of Enugu State from today will take over the medical uh, facility, medical bill, everything concerning this girl. And the government of Enugu State in giving this girl scholarship to any level she wants to go to. She has improved a lot and uh, her chances of full recovery are high. Members of civil society organizations in the state are demanding for justice. The last straw that led them to uh, driving a nail or drilling a nail into her skull was the fact that they said that they gave her a child to a baby to carry well almost close to midnight. It's, it's, it's a shame. It's a such an ugly phenomenon that shames humanity because it brings out the beast in humanity. It brings out the beast in human beings, some human beings. The people of Akodiawa community in the Boetiti local government area of Enugu state who are kinsmen of the maid's parents, they have taken up the responsibility of caring for the widow and the girl's siblings. The matter has been adjourned to 10th of August, while the couple are currently remanded at the Nsuka Correctional Facility. Bamidila Jai, TVC News, Enugu.